when June was about six months old, we started noticing when she would eat that she had some swelling and redness on her cheek and brought it to our pediatrician's attention. And our pediatrician had actually noticed beforehand Jane had some cafe au lait spots. At that time, kind of had an idea that it might be NF. And it was later that she had her first MRI and noticed the extent of the tumor. We're in Connecticut and we went up to Boston. After about a year and a half, they noticed it was kind of growing at an accelerated rate and that's when they referred us down to NIH. There's a lot of testing. Like every time we go, yeah. Jane has blood work. And MRI. MRI, and we have to write everything down. Like, yes. I would always be the one who would make sure to wake her up, make sure to write it down. But now that she's older, she gets up, she announces, I'm taking my medicine, and writes down her, <laughs> keeps the log herself. I would look at the clock, see what time it is, like, see if I feel like getting up and going to take my medicine. If I do, go take it, and then go back to sleep. The first medicine only stopped my tumor from growing for a few months. The second didn't work at all, but then I got to try MEC. My tumor has shrank 33%. up an old video of her at Halloween. My voice has gotten deep, deeper yes, so much. Like it was remarkable looking at her. When I knew what it was, I just said it's a tumor. Remarkable to me to look at her face and see. Um, I thought that your your cheek had shrunk in the picture, I thought, or compared to now. Hmm. She may have NF, but NF doesn't have